Hi, I'm Nathaniel Deal, and I'm here to give you a quick overview of some add-ons for the ammo counter kit. Um, so I got a lot of requests for the full ammo counter kit. Just right out of the box, just put it on the blaster and, and get going. So um, I've looked into some options, I looked into some 3D printing options, and um, I was able to come up with a nice design to hold the IR beam. Um, this is the design. It's a flash muzzle for any blaster that has the coupler on the end. So it's in two pieces. Uh, this piece right here holds the IR beam, and this piece right here is for the coupler. So they just go together like this, and you screw it on the end of your blaster. Also, I've been working on a scope, um, 3D scope. I haven't got that done yet, so I am offering a, uh, a custom Nitron scope. Um, this is the Nitron scope just out of the box. So what I do with this is I take um, these three panes of plastic out in the middle, I remove all the electronics in, inside, and I add the ammo counter into it, um, along with a couple 3D printed pieces that um, hold some buttons on the end here, and hold the LED here, and kind of like a stopper in the back. So um, I'll give you an overview on this blaster, um, on how this works. So. Here's the 3D pinned piece. Um, there's a wire that comes down through this hole and up through this connector so you can take them apart. And then the connector goes into the Nitron scope and connects to the, uh, the Arduinos down here. Um, the ammo counter kit is up here. And you can see um, the buttons that I was talking about. So here's the power switch. I turn that. It should come on and then also there's a reset button here and a toggle button here so if i click the toggle button we'll go through the different clip sizes and then as far as the front you can see it's just a 3d pinned piece that fits in there to kind of keep it all clean and looking looking nice so um if you're interested in this i will be offering on ammocounter.com um the whole set the nitro blaster with the arduino with the kit with the battery 3D printed pieces and this piece at the end. And I think I have some in the clip. Looks like there's about eight or so in there. So I'll give you a firing test and that'll be it. So again, thanks for watching. Um, just a quick overview of these two parts available on ammocounter.com. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't and like, thank you.